ladies and gentlemen, it's Wendy here again. Stop it up, demonstrate living in Albert, Pembrokeshire, Wales. Now, I've just been fiddling today and I think I've come up with quite a good plan. Right, what it's going to be, it's going to be... A bookmark holder. Be able to slip and... Don't only really take one, it take quite a few bookmarks. So now we can start with the measuring and the bits like that. And then do, 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 do. oh scoring board. I just you oh see. <laughs> and then what I tend to do if I have an idea, then I'll draw it out. Okay, so it, you know, these two sides. That and that are going to be cut off, okay? So what you need to do now, you need to... Oh, I go down there, or oh, a pencil, and if I put... Oops. Just a little mark on there, which is at... eight inches then what I can do is oh dear <laughs> get off go off 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 right put that back there now eight inches and we need to score all the way across yeah so that's an eight inches so you turn it we go back to this is how I use my so I score it at that point and that point but I only need to score from the the to the you see this you only need to score from that line or this up so what I do I I will put my um copy on the top and I'll do that then you've got a mark there that you can score by okay then do one there no do one there and then because you're going to find it, haven't you? Just go there. And the same the other side. Get your template on top and do a line there and a line there through the paper. And then you've got one line there. That's that line. And Just move it a bit so you're actually on the. It should have come through, yeah. There we go. Well, it will be when I get it straight. Oh, come on. So you've got. Where did that come from? Probably the end of my thing of my jigs, but never mind, we won't, we won't be seeing that. Now then what we need to do, where's my pencil, ah oh, there we are, right, what we need to do now, I hope you're following all of this so that you're not bored, right, one centimetre down, so we go around here, so what we're doing now, we do the little flap bit, so, from, again from this line, you go down one centimetre and you put a little nick, and then on this side, you go one centimetre and put a little bit. Now then, what you need to do now... Yeah, I've got to go that way as well, haven't I? Yes. And... <coughs> I 
I need to go that way. Um, one centimeter there. Okay. Now then, what we need to do now, we need to find the score line. Very close to where we want it to be. Maybe over there. And then what we do is we take our scissors and we cut this piece from there to this on all fours. Okay, then we can move that one out of the way. Oh, I kiffed sometimes, I tell you. I do everything upside down and back to front. Right, so that's that. Now that we need to finish all of these. Well, that's going to be quite difficult, isn't it? Just bear with me. <laughs> right, from this inside one now, which is the inside one, we need to, that is at one and a half. We need to go down now. That score line. And the same here, it's at uh, straighten it up, Wendy. What a useless person, I tell you. And three and three quarters. Let you take it down. Now, I. I I haven't done this with the with my scoreboard, but I expect you can, you know what to do with it. What we need to do now, we need to cut off these two side pieces. Um, don't don't throw them away because they will be you know they can come in use for a variety of things. Like you said, you probably get a straighter line if you do it on the, um, the cutter. It is something, actually, that I really should practice on doing. Uh, using my cutter more. But then it's like everything. You, you sort of think, oh, yeah, it'll do that. What I want to do is do that for me. And when you do, that's it. Then. That's all you, you actually will do with it. You won't go outside the line and and think of other things, right? Now that this piece also we cut off. Okay, straight as I can. Now then what we need to do now and now we need to mark this area here. Just put a fade mark there, and I know that some of you have got, um, oh I've got one, <laughs> I've got one of these, no, which, right, every step of the way, now please be careful when you do this, I don't want to hear if you cut in all your limbs off because of this right now just follow that line oh these are sharp i got it in a local um, supermarket just across well i didn't um my little helper she does so much for me that she got it for me oh, dear, dear, dear. that's actually come off or not Just tidy it up then. Should have used a ruler, shouldn't I? Yeah, well. 
I'm sure that yours will be far more tidier than mine. But what we do now is we fold that over, fold that over, and that will, well, because I've done, just done it, I didn't score that properly, did I? <laughs> didn't make the hole big enough. Fill that in, fill that in. You could also put magnets in there, which I was going to do, but I couldn't find any of my magnets. So here we are. And put in now this little bookmark. And there we go. It, you know, it'll it'll help. But you know, if you're going to post it to some, post them to somebody, then put another piece of cardboard in there or because we've scored twice there, there's quite a little gap down there. You could put a few more in. Okay, thank you for watching. And what I'll try and do, I'll try and do the uh, template again. And um, I'll put it on my blog, I think, today. So thank you for watching. And I really do hope that you've got made some sense out of this. Thank you. See you soon. Bye.